favorite of the month and since this is my first video favorite video uh, technically these items are my go-to products and without them my life is not complete so yeah so yeah you know these are items that i'm really excited to show you so hope you stay tuned and don't forget to thumbs up this video if you like it let's get started so the first item is the Revlon Matte Lip Balm. It, the shade is Sultry and I'm wearing it right now. Um, the colour is a beautiful warm dark pink, right? It's a beautiful warm dark pink and it lasts the whole day actually. It fades a little throughout the day but it still retains its opacity. Yeah. You know like dark skin girls, you have like dark tone lips and, and center lighter. Um, this one still works fine even throughout the day, so yeah, I really like this one. If you can't get the Revlon Matte Lip Balm, uh, in the shade Sultry especially, because it sells out so fast all the time, so I suggest you get the uh, Wet n Wild Lipstick in Spike with Rum. Uh, this shade is so similar with Revlon, Revlon, Revlon Sultry, so whenever I wear it on my lips, it didn't seem, I don't see any difference. So that's a good thing. The only, the shade is the same but long lasting. Mm, you have to try the blotting technique to see how fast, how long it lasts. So yeah, that's one. My next favorite is the Maybelline Master Drama. Um, it's a black pencil eyeliner. And I use this for doing my wing eyeliner and all the stuff. It's the blackest black of all the pencil liner I've owned. And it's so smooth that it glides on so smoothly and it doesn't tuck on my eyelids so that's a really good thing I think I won't get any other drugstore pencil eyeliner other than this because yeah I've tried them all and this works the best um, however there's two cons with this pencil eyeliner is that one you can't retract the eyeliner back you can only push it forward but not back um, so that it's already written on the packaging so you kind of know what you're paying for and the second con is that you can't really use this on your waterline it doesn't really transfer that well so that brings me to my second product which is the Colossal Kajal by Maybelline this is a waterproof pencil eyeliner it's a black one yep. and it's waterproof and this one works well on my waterline I have sensitive eyes and it gets cheery so fast every two hours I think you'll start tearing up so this eyeliner works fine for my sensitive eyes and I'll definitely recommend this to people who have sensitive eyes yeah it works pretty well and it lasts quite long even with cheery eyes um, I heard Lapni was having a similar one like this and based on review it says it's actually more creamier than this one but because of the creaminess, it will not last on eyes that cheers up easily. So that's why I opted for this one. So I, I think after I'm done with this, I'll try to get that one, the Luck Me one, and give it a try. If not, I'll, if that doesn't work for me, I'll come back to this one definitely. I think this is my like standard right now. If <laughs> It's my standard product for my waterline right now. Uh, my next favorite item is the Pixi Gentle Moist Cleansing Lotion. Um, it says it's without alcohol and it uses original honey. So that's a, those are the claims and I really like this one because I feel that it is the most gentle makeup remover for my eyes. Like I said earlier, I had sensitive eyes. So I can definitely use this near my waterline or anywhere near my eyeballs. It will not irritate as much. Um, so far, it, I'm, pretty, I'm pretty comfortable using this near my waterline and eyeballs, so I don't have any problems with that, which is a good thing. It's very hard to find products like this for my eye type. And I actually previously bought the small version, the travel size version, and I really liked it, so I got the full version. Actually, it's a full version. It's quite small, actually. How many ml? 100 ml. Not bad actually, it's quite cheap. I forgot how much was it, but it's less than 5 10 ringgit. Yeah, that was the price. It's a really good one. It smells like jasmine, too. Yeah, it smells quite, quite nice. It smells nice.
Uh, the next item is the Essence Silky Touch Blush. Oh my god, I love this one. I'm wearing it right now, but I don't think you can see it. Can you? I'm not sure. On camera, maybe you can. It's actually a warm, peachy tone. The kind of blush, the kind of peachy blush that I've been looking for that could work on darker skin tones, darker skin tones, and this one works really nice. It looks a bit pinkish here, I think. Yeah, it looks kind of pinkish. But it's actually a warm peachy tone, and it has a um, glowy finish, satin finish, I think. Yeah, it has a satin finish, and it's really nice. You can see some glitter on it, but it doesn't transfer too much on your cheeks but it does give you a glowy effect and you know all the celebrity glows where they get them I think it's this one <laughs> it gives the same effect so this is the best one I love it so much I think I'll use it throughout the year even though it's not summer mm -hmm. oh yeah the shade here is autumn peach exactly the same autumn peach it looks the same as the name it's autumn peach Why not? Really nice. Alright, uh, next item is the e.l.f. makeup removal pen. I think you've seen this in my first video where I was using this in my eyeliner. Yeah, I really love using this with the wing eye look and stuff like that just to make a quick correction or especially on days where I have mascara smudges. Just take this pop, zoop, 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 done, settle, settle. <laughs> So yeah, I really like this one. It's for quick touch up. This is the best one. Mm, next item is next favorite 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 item. You can see it's not in any order at all. So my next favorite item is a uh, moisturizer, and this is from Simplicity Derma Magic Beauty Moisturizer. Um, this moisturizer is quite nice. It has all the skincare benefits and I really do see some if changes from it I'm not promoting I'm not making this up nobody paid me to say this but I do see some changes in my skin tone I feel like it's not that dull anymore whenever I use this and especially in my neck area I've been using it and I don't see the lines that visible as in my previous video I think my first video it's so visible I think but now it's not so visible and so I noticed some changes in it so yeah I really like this and it has a dewy effect on this moisturizer I haven't seen any moisturizer that gives me a dewy effect that stays throughout the day you know and sometimes I really like to use this just by its own I don't even wear powder I just wear this by its own and just go out <laughs> it's really nice I think I would definitely repurchase this one especially for the skincare benefits yeah, I don't see any paraben written on this ingredient, so that's a bonus. I have to double check on that one. It's not written here, but it's written on the box when you purchase it. So I guess that's nice. So far, it's my favorite. Mm -hmm. I've tried many moisturizers, and so far, this is the one that I've been going back to. And yeah, the main reasons that I like this is because of the skincare benefit and of the dewy glow that it gives off. That's awesome. Just like a uh, celebrity glow, you know. You know how celebrities look so glowy all the time? If you want that glow, use this one. Alright, for the next item, it's one of my favorite palettes. Um, I have here is the 120 color palette by BH Cosmetic. I'm having the second edition palette. Um, this palette has all the basic and bright colors that you will need. So that's why I purchased this one. Um, my favorite colors would be the navy blue, dark purple, all the brown shades really work for me. And there's a matte black and matte white here. So it's really nice to have this. So if you're really a beginner, you can definitely check this one out because it has all the shades that you need and you don't have to have 10 palettes to have all, all the shades. Um, yeah, it's definitely a nice variety of shades here that you can try out and it has different finishes. It has matte finish, satin finish and the glitter finish. So I can say majority of it is the matte and satin finish. Only a few of them are glitter. So it's really nice especially for beginners. So 
so I definitely recommend this palette. Okay, last two more items is the e.l.f. Eyebrow Kit. I've been using this quite a lot lately and it, you can get a natural effect to a bold effect if you want. Natural, you can use the powder or you want the wax to get a bolder look. I'm using it today too and it's quite nice. I really like it. I'm not sure that it's waterproof or anything because it tends to go out if you're sweaty and all that stuff. But for now, I really like it. Uh, the shade I'm using here is medium. So yeah, I think you should give it a try. I, I got it for like 10 ringgit. So it's quite cheap for an eyebrow product. I've never seen a cheaper one before. So if you know one, let me know. Um, yeah, this one's so fun. I've been enjoying this. Uh, last one. Uh, another thing is the nail polish. Oh my god, you guys. If you heard of Elianto, you need to get this nail polish from them. Um, the shade here is Nude. I think this is their new range nail polish. This shade is like a peachy, peachy pink. Peachy pink. Some, some in in some lightings it looks peachy. On other light different types of lightings it looks more pinky. So yeah, definitely a combo of the two colors. It's really nice and really nice new color. Any skin tone can rock this color. Believe me, I recommend this to a lot of different skin tone friends with different skin tones and all of them love this. So yeah, I should give this a try. And I've been using this quite a lot. And you can see, I'm not sure if you can see, I've already used like halfway here. I usually don't use that much nail polish, but after I got this, everything gone crazy. Start wearing this almost every month, every week, every, every day. I really like this. So, yeah, I think you will definitely want to check this out as well. It's a beautiful color, okay? I'm serious. Once you try it, you'll be like, damn! <laughs> so, yeah, give this a try, okay? Alright guys, that's all for my favourites. I hope you enjoyed all my favourites and definitely check out some of the products that I re recommended earlier. And if you have any other favourite products, do let me know in the comment section so I can check it out. So that's all for today. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Have you ever felt? Are you listening? Damn. Yeah. Uh. Yeah.